Welcome to this introduction to the Roof Raptor module in StrutCalc. To activate this module, click the ninth icon on the toolbar. This module allows you to design a Roof Raptor for most applications. You will notice that there are five main inputs needed to complete this design. The first input is the roof pitch. Next you have the span length as well as the length of the eave. All of this information is available in the plans of the structure being designed. Next you have the roof live loads and dead loads. These are default values and are considered to be the industry standards. You can also check for uplift by replacing the gravity roof live load with a negative uplift load. Depending on your geographic location, you can indicate if you wish to use snow or non-snow for the design. StrutCalc will default to the snow load when you open the module. You can also click the non-snow option and StrutCalc will automatically calculate the applicable roof live load based on the roof pitch and the area of coverage that the rafters support. Under the non-snow icon, you have the option to override the calculated live load if you wish to use something different. There are two additional items to consider in your design. The first is for bracing applied to the bottom of the rafters. This is only applicable when your eave length is relatively large compared to your span length. The last checkbox is for the double live load on the eave. This will be used in snow regions where you have load concentrations on the eave due to the melting of snow on the main span, then the refreezing of the water when it gets to the eave. StrutCalc allows you to design rafters using any of the materials available in the materials property window, including solid sawn, glue lambs, structural composite, eye joists, steel, and tube steel shapes. It also allows you to design using pressure treated wood by checking the apply and sizing factor checkbox. You can also use auto size to help with your design if you wish. Print preview will detail all the necessary design characteristics on a one page printout as shown here. That concludes this quick review of the Roof Rafter module. Thank you for watching this video.